Sports' Saeed Abbas talked to experts who witnessed the case unfold. Hi, Jill. Even after all these years, the fascination people have with the pizza bomber case has not ended. We spoke to experts who were involved in the case and also caught up with what they're doing now. Brian Sheridan, who is now the communication department chair at Mercyhurst University, was a journalist at Jet24 News during the pizza bomber case. Sheridan remembers waiting to go live, and just minutes before his live shot, the collar bomb around Brian Wells' neck detonated. Wells was a pizza delivery man for Mamma Mia Pizzeria in Erie for many years. The case not only got national attention, but also international with new shows in Ireland, England, and Australia. Experts say the interest remains in the story because of it being so bizarre. According to Sheridan, Bill Rothstein, who died of cancer in 2004, was the smartest out of all the suspects involved in the case. For me, my first thought was, don't over-dramatize this. A man is dead. We don't know circumstances surrounding it. He apparently just robbed a bank. But I did not need, as the reporter, to add any drama to this. Coming up at 5.30, we talk to former FBI Special Agent Jerry Clark, who is now the department chair of the Criminal Justice Program at Gannon University. Back to you, Sean. All right, thank you.